What's going on everyone? I'm here in Tehran, the capital and biggest city of Iran, and I'm about to go golfing at one of the only courses here. I think this is the driving range. Oh, is that the pro guy? What's his name? Mr. Tabari. Tabari. Hello. How are you? We're on the first tee box. Nice shot. You can see the Tehran TV tower in the distance right there. Yeah, I mean, the course is a little bit run down, but it's still, you know, beautiful to be out here. Oh, hit the tree? Yeah. <laughs> really? Oh man, I thought that was good. Oh, that was terrible. It was not so good. I shanked it. Gotta play all the bad shots, you know? All right, so I don't have a ball, so. Oh, almost made it. It's a funny situation here, because I lost the ball in the first hole, and I don't know if he has another one. Tell him I won't lose this one. Well, I'll try not to. This is a really deep hole. The green is like there. 225 yards. Damn. I have a question for him. So, is golf popular in Iran? Are there many people playing? Mahdude. Yeah, not, not very popular. So, just few people are playing golf. How many courses are in Tehran? Uh, only this field in Tehran. In Arizona, in my state, there's like yeah. 350 courses. The gentleman says that maybe in whole Tehran, only 50 people play golf. And Tehran has like 15 million people. Oh, golf is very frustrating. It's the most frustrating game ever. All right, I didn't hit the green, but I'm close. I'm just here. Not bad. Oh, good shot. Oh, bogey. I almost have it. I like this guy. We've got a nice little walkway here through the trees, heading up to the third hole. And it just opens up to the beauty. Oh, this is hole five. We must have skipped a few holes. Wait, ask him how this is hole five and 14. How is it both holes? They have uh, five fields, yeah? So, and they turn, you know, they do a kind of uh, Ro circle. They rotation. They rotation, exactly. Best one of the day. New French Oh, got a powerful swing. I watch a guy on YouTube. His name is Garrett Clark. Yeah, I know him. Yeah, yeah. He's so, a YouTuber. I know. I'm a YouTuber too. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know a guy named Eric Anders? He's another. Yeah. yeah. Oh my God, man! Look at this. I cannot stress how cool it was that this morning I was skiing on the top of that mountain, and now I'm playing golf here in Iran. What a f cool experience! All right, so we got 180 yards. I got a six iron. Well, I think I hit the green. I might be like 20 feet left. I don't know. It's hard to tell. This is like my two favorite things in the world are travel and golf, and I'm doing them both right now. It doesn't get any better than this. Oh. I hit it too hard because it's so slow. These greens are tough, man. How did you get interested in golf, being from Iran? We got for the first time four years ago. Oh, my nice. father got into golf about nine years ago. Got it. And he lured me to do He lured you in. Yeah. I love golf, man. I grew up playing golf my whole life, and I've been to every country in the world, and I always play when I can. All right, nice shot. Good shot. Whoa. Yeah. Did you see that? Yeah. <laughs> That thing was hopping everywhere. You should have told me not to hit a putter off the game. Get in. All right, last putt here for par. This is to go back to back pars here in Iran. There we go. That was an incredible experience golfing in Iran. Beautiful weather, nice people. And uh, man, thank you guys for watching this video and I'll see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching Drew Binsky Golf. Make sure to subscribe to this channel if you wanna see more golf adventures all around the world. And I'd love to connect with you guys on Instagram, so hit me up at Binsky Golf. Take care guys, hit them straight, and I'll see you on the course.